Hello friends, my name is Jay Onright and I'm a sportscaster at TSN, but for the past six years, I've lived here in Kensington Market. I know, it's amazing! I'm the new king of Kensington! Do you want to see how I spend a typical day in this beautiful part of the city, this historic part of the city, a part of the city you should come visit? Well, come on! Right behind me, Bikes on Wheels. What a great bike store. I bought my Linus Cruiser bike there because I am a hipster in waiting. And right over here, Cafe Paminar, delicious coffee. In fact, I'm actually in the mood for Americano, so let's go inside. Come on! Kensington Market is a wonderful place to come for a coffee. Ideal coffee, moonbeam coffee, and here at Paminar, where I'm going to order an Americano, sir. Sure. Oh, thank you. Oh, yeah. Ah, maybe blow on it a little bit. Come on. Well, we've come further down Augusta to Wanda's Pie in the Sky. And I know this is going to shock you, but they sell pies here and good ones. I mean, whenever I go to someone's house for dinner, instead of trying to make something myself, I simply stop at Wanda's, I grab a pie, I show up, and I'm a hero, a darn hero. You could be a hero too, you should come in here and they make nice teas too and sandwiches. It's a great place. About three or four times a week I come to eat here at Big Fat Burrito. Maybe that seems like too much, but the burritos are so good. They do delicious chips and salsa and guacamole and tacos too. Hey, let me tell you something. If Big Fat Burrito is good for Mayor Ford, then it's good enough for you too. You can meet a lot of good friends in the market too. You just have to get down to their level. We were so lucky when Model Citizen moved here from Dundas West about five years ago. This is a beautiful, beautiful clothing store and a place to come to get new clothing. I mean, there's lots of great vintage clothes obviously on Kensington, but if you want the new stuff, this is an amazing place to come. Beautiful women's clothing on this side, men's stuff over here. I like their ties. I wear their ties on TV all the time. And then look at these beautiful silkscreen t-shirts. In fact, I happen to be wearing one myself right now. I'll put a bird on it. The Bungalow is a beautiful store. There's Bungalow and then across the street here on Augusta there's Bungalow West. If you want beautiful teak vintage furniture from the 60s or 70s, awesome vintage clothing, this is the place to go. But if you're looking for a gift for the person who's a big foodie in your life, uh, the person who loves cookbooks and loves cooking accessories and all that fun stuff, you gotta come to Good Egg. It is one of the coolest stores, not just in the market, but in the entire city. Come on! we are right there in the heart of the entire city. These are beautiful little posters. But if you're looking for a real Toronto-centric gift, this is such a great store to come to. Look at this. They put together an entire table of Toronto and Canadian stuff. Nothing wrong with the Stuart McLean book, right? For a gift, that's a nice thing to have. Anything you could possibly want. Crumpled City Toronto, Utopia, Towards a New Toronto, Margaret Atwood books. This is the place to come for Toronto-centric gifts for sure. This is Oxford Fruit on the corner of Nassau and Augusta. What a beautiful little store. I mean, this is where I come every day to get my tomatoes or my asparagus or my avocados, which will ripen into beautiful, beautiful avocado, make great guacamole, which I will eat all myself. I won't share it with anyone because I'm greedy that way. I like to keep the market bounty to myself. Oh, this street is amazing now because it's a mecca of Latin American delights. Seven Lives Tacos over here, delicious fish tacos, right this way, sir. And then Emporium Latino for beautiful, beautiful Mexican food. And right behind Ian is Jumbo Empanadas. I mean, this place is unbelievable. Chilean delights, delicious fresh baked empanadas every single day. And they make the best salads too. I don't know what they put in that dressing, but I don't want to know because I just want to come to Jumbo Empanadas and have them make the dressing and the salad for me. That's what the market's all about. 
You know, one of the best new restaurants here in the market, Pizzeria Via Mercanti, real, real Neapolitan pizza made by wonderful people here inside. And if you're wondering, can I bring my family to the market? This is a perfect family restaurant for you to hang out at, take a break. If you've got the family here in the market hanging out for the day and they need a rest, these guys will take care of you, I assure you. Let's go inside and see them preparing all the great stuff for the day. Come on. You know, there's nothing like cheese. It's what makes the world go round. Isn't that right, little birdies? Well, here in the market, we have two wonderful cheesemongers. There's Global Cheese, which was recently renovated and has an amazing selection of stuff. And then here at Cheese Magic, I love it because they introduced me to the wonderful world of Beamster. Let's go inside and, uh, and buy some Beamster. You know, one of the great things about coming to Cheese Magic is you can learn about cheeses you might not normally know about. For instance, I didn't know what Beamster was until these guys taught me. And now I eat it obsessively. Probably too much, but I can't stop and I don't care. Little Beamster, please. Thank you. And you get samples, too. Mmm. Mm. So crumbly. Creamy and crumbly. It's delicious. You could sit here all day. That's perfect. Mmm. Mmm. That really is unbelievable. Mmm. Anything else? That's it, sir. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Nice service, good people. And if you don't know what you want, just ask. They might be able to help you. And they, they will be able to help you. I know that. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Oh, the receipt. That's right. Just in case I want to return it, which I won't be doing. I'll be eating it. Look at that. Beautiful cheese. Look at that. Mmm. Thank you. Mmm. Try a high five. Let's take this and go to the butcher shop. You know, uh, this used to be the home of European meats and it was here for years and years. It was the heart of the market and recently they've left and a lot of us who lived in the market were concerned. Uh, what butcher shop would come in and take its place? We couldn't be happier because Pete Sanigan has moved from that side of Baldwin into the old European meat space and it is an amazing butcher shop and I highly encourage you to come visit because it's the kind of place that makes you want to come back to the market again and again. Let's go inside to Sanigan's and see what they've got. You know, Pete Sanigan said he wanted this butcher shop to feel like one of the great butcher shops in New York or London, and I think he's done it. I mean, look at this beautiful deli counter. You have everything you could possibly want here for a party, or if you're just lazy like I am, you grab this pre-made marinara sauce and make a pasta for yourself. And then I love to come here for sandwiches. Look at this beautiful rotisserie chicken and all the great sandwiches they're doing at the lunch counter here. You could stop here anytime for that. And then over here, look at all this wonderful food over here. All these great steaks and sausages and everything is sourced locally. Pete, make sure of that. It's an amazing butcher shop, and if you're in the market for meat, I highly recommend you come to Sanigan's. And now we are on Kensington, right in the heart of Kensington, and this is the street famous for all the vintage clothing stores like Courage My Love, and it's a great place to come for that, but it's also a great place to come for one other thing. Two words, mini cupcakes. You gotta come into Cora's Bakery, Miss Cora's Kitchen. This is the place for mini cupcakes. I may be addicted. Don't judge me. Look at this. So Miss Cora has made me a beautiful mini cupcake here, and I don't even care if there are pink sprinkles on it. In fact, I encourage that. This is a little slice of heaven right here, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, that's so good. It's so moist. Mmm. This makes you happy instantly. That's all you need. And in life, it's just a mini cupcake, and you're happy for the rest of the day. Mm. Got to come here for them. Really, really good. Mm. It's 
It's going to go well with my Beamster. You know, even though I report on sports, my real love is music, and now I'm so lucky because one of the best music shops in the city has moved into the market, Sonic Boom Records. Let's go find some vinyl. I'll probably spend way more than I should in this store, but I love it. This is such a great, great store, and it just came into the market, and I'm afraid I'm addicted to it. Sonic Boom used to be up in the annex, and now it's here in the market. They do vintage vinyl, but they also do brand new stuff as well. You should get into the vinyl revolution. It's a wonderful way to listen to music. You can listen to this copy of this wonderful Vancouver indie rock super group, the New Pornographers electric version, brand new copy. You can pick that up, or if you want something used, how about the Bird's Greatest Hits for $3.99? Are you kidding me? That's just chock full of great tunes. Mr. Tambourine Man, turn, 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 eight miles high. You can't go wrong with that. This is a great store to come to. And another thing I love about it is if you're looking for a gift for your music-loving friend, they've got a wonderful selection of books as well. And not just music books. I mean, look at this. Bukowski's Women. This is for your heavy drinker friend. And then you have all these great, I love these 33 and a third albums. You want to you want to learn exactly how OK Computer came to be? You pick that bad boy up right there. Or if you want to learn everything you wanted to know about classic rock t-shirts, this is the best. This is the place to come for gifts for friends. And then maybe I'll pick up this copy of Between the Buttons as well. Because how can you go wrong? Look at those young whippersnappers. So now it's time for lunch, and I love to come here to Fresco's Fish and Chips. The fish and chips are good, the chicken wings are good, but my favorite deal is the poutine and a pop deal. There's no better place for Canada's national dish than to come here, five bucks, poutine and a pop. It's the best deal in the city. Let's go eat some cheese curds and gravy. I mean, really, is there a better deal in the city? Look at all these delicious fresh cut fries and all these cheese curds and gravy. This is so tasty. And I eat here several times a week. Thank you, sir. Thanks a lot, Jim. And put that in there. There we go. This is, this is for my cameraman, I swear. It's not for me. It's for my cameraman. It's for my cameraman. Grab a fork. So now I'm here in Bellevue Park after a long day of shopping and exploring the market with my friend Al Waxman. The late Al Waxman, of course, was the original King of Kensington and he grew up in the area and you can come see his statue here in Bellevue Park anytime, day or night. I hope you've had a great day hanging out in my hood. It's a, it's a place I love to call home and I hope you come visit sometime soon. And if you see me, say hello, okay?